Hello everybody, welcome to Just Upright. My name is Doc Jane Ruder. I'm a doctor of physical therapy and I'm a certified dementia practitioner. If you are new to my channel, welcome. And I would like to thank my subscribers, my viewers, thumbs up to you guys. Thank you so much. Thank you for those emailing me about the feedback about the channel. I really appreciate it. Thank you guys. For those of you who are new to my channel, you can explore the channel. You can hit the playlist. And under the playlist, I group together the videos that I made per topic. So I have videos on how to become a physical therapist here in the United States. I have videos on how to be an on-call therapist or being a PRN. Videos on um, wellness, health, practical tips to improve your posture, your balance, and decrease fall risk and fun inspirational videos so check the playlist out so if you're looking for something specific and also check amazon.com i have my published books there i have wedding guest book i also have recipe notebook and as well as uh, different beautifully designed planners i have monthly planners I have two-year planner, five-year planner that you can choose from. I also have uh, journals, some memories of you journals and different kinds of journals. Uh, beautifully designed, I also have our tennis score sheet, skydiving that book, and many other things that just this book, that just upright, practical tips, and PT Path to US. So I have tons of other published books on Amazon.com. Just type G I N A L Y N Ruder, and it will all show up. Except for, of course, for the sponsored products, they are not mine. You can see my name if uh, the item is mine. Uh, I have um, sketchbook. I have uh, kids uh, books. Also, I have guitar. Um, tab notebook i have a uh, coloring notebooks and tons of other books that you can choose from so check those ones out thank you so much for your support so today i'm going to discuss uh the biggest mistake that uh working visa or h1b working visa holder make so i've been you know part of uh, many facebook group involving our industry in the therapy especially here in the u.s and i've been seeing posts one after another of our colleagues having dilemma problems that their working visa has expired and the employer hasn't taken action to renew it they are afraid of being de deported okay what are they going to do so there are just so many problems uh, if you let the visa the working visa expire and you did not uh, renew it on time okay so first let's go to the USCIS and see about what is the validity of an H1B or a working okay. visa so if for example you google it H1B visa USCIS I went down to H1B specialty occupations. I clicked that one. Okay, so you can uh, trust that this website is the official website of USCIS because it's .gov. Okay, so as you can see, we go down here. Here, H1B petitions for initial period up to three years and can grant extensions up to additional three years. Under certain circumstances, USCIS may extend an H-1B worker's employment authorization beyond the six-year limit. So as you can see, once you are granted the working visa or H-1B visa, which is most uh, physical occupational therapists, foreign trained use uh, to work here temporarily in the U.S., uh, you have initially a three-year period of validity. Uh, and then you can renew it for another three years. The problem lies among uh, our colleagues uh, who do not uh, necessarily know that they have to follow up with their employer, okay? That, uh, for example, second year already passed. That is ideally the, you know, the initial part that you should communicate with your employer and ask, hey, uh, I just noticed that my working visa is about to expire. What is our next step? Okay, uh, you have to coordinate with your employer, with the agency, uh, because sometimes there are changes in the staffing 
and sometimes the communication is not being clear that this certain uh, employee needs um, renewal of the working visa and it will expire in on this date okay so something is falling through the crack and you don't want to be that person okay you don't want that three-year period is up and nothing happened okay so you have to make sure you have to coordinate uh, with the office with the management uh, you know one year or in six months especially that before your working visa is about to expire that you know you want to know what's the next step is so there are options uh, for foreign trained therapists uh, depending on what agency or company you work for uh, another one option is again just like it's stated in the USCIS your employer can file for another three year of a working visa okay so you can have another working visa a renewal of your working visa another one is you can apply for an immigrant uh, visa okay um, but it depends on the company or agency you work for um, some company will say okay we will file for you an immigrant visa but you have to extend your contract with us or we will file for an immigrant visa for you but you have to shoulder the expenses for the processing fee and the lawyer okay so um, it depends again in your unique situation uh, what company or what um, agency you work for the setup that you will do before the working visa expires okay so another another scenario that I've uh, read before from colleagues is that their working visa is about to expire and they were not satisfied with that employer uh, they began actively searching for another employer who uh, are willing to file for them once their working visa expire with another uh, with the you know with the current employer that they have or the candidate has but um, you have to make sure sure that before you jump from one employer to another that you are not in a uh, bind with contract with whoever petition you to go to here to the US okay so you have to make sure that your contract is fully satisfied that you're done finished with all the total number of hours stated in the contract before you can change employer or if your employer is gonna let you go depending on the conditions that they set or you have to pay a certain amount and things like that the key thing here guys is do not let your working visa expire without the necessary plan what will come next after the expiration Okay, so again, will you extend with the same employer? Will the employer file for an immigrant visa for you? Will you find another employer if you are done with your contract with the agency or the company who petitioned you initially to go here to the US? So uh, do not get into trouble that some of our colleagues have to experience because their working visa expired and they're afraid that uh, they might not be able to work, that they might be sent back to the, their country because their working visa expired. Okay, so what will happen if it's already expired and your employer is not uh, filing an extension for you uh, or you're just in limbo, you don't know what to do? Uh, this is the time that you should consult an immigration lawyer, okay? And you have to work with the lawyer in order for you not to be of course kick out of the country just because your working visa expired uh, if you go to the USCIS I will put the link below uh, the website uh, and there's another useful website the SGM law group I'm not connected to them I just like their website because it explains uh, a lot of things about the visa in a layman's term that you know uh, easy, can easily be understood and I will put the link down below also so that you can read on and be guided but the best thing to do is to consult an immigration lawyer so, so I hope this is helpful and I hope that this will help uh, other colleagues who are new here in the US with a working visa not to have uh, the same problems are as our other colleagues have because they are just 
very trusting that their employer is gonna renew their uh, working visa automatically without them trying to coordinate. You always have to be on top of the game. You always be vigilant uh, whether your visa is you know gonna be renewed or not because you don't want to experience the headaches, the problems, and uh, you know needing to pay the lawyer just because it lapses because it expired and you don't know what to do. Okay, so thank you so much for watching. Please share this video. Please share this channel to your sphere of influence so we can help as many people as we can for as much as we can. Thank you so much and stay blessed. Thank you so much for watching. Please do not forget to hit the subscribe button below to be updated with the latest video releases. Share this channel to other people you know who will benefit from just upright videos. Thank you again and stay blessed.